Whoa, Vikings, I didn't see you there. Jeez, you surprised me. Today we're going to be asking some questions about the enrichment system that, well, haven't been asked yet. One being, hey, Mr. Galloway, if I, if I have a math stamp on a math priority day and the class is full, what do I do? Cameron, that is a great question. That shouldn't happen, though, because the teachers are the ones that are keeping track of who they stamp for their priority days. So full sessions for those classes shouldn't be an issue, bud. Mr. Galloway, if I don't have their class this term, can I still go to Mrs. Fendel and Mr. Blaine's class, even if I don't have their class this term? Hey, Cameron, that is another great question. Hey, and if it's an open session, you betcha, you can go to any class. A lot of the teachers will be having activities planned. Some of those are going to be extensions. So if it's an open class, you betcha, you can sure go there. If it's closed, however, you'll only be able to get into that class if you have a stamp. Mr. Hudson, what if I forget my planner? All right, Vikings, that's a great question. Unfortunately, if you don't have your planner, you're going to have to go directly to the cafeteria. We're going to have to assign you a detention, and then if we can determine what enrichment you're supposed to be in, we'll get you there. Otherwise, you're just going to have to study in the cafeteria that day. Back to you, Cameron. Okay, that sounds great. Thanks for being so helpful. But what if all the enrichment classes are full and I don't have any stamps? All right, so that's a good question. In that case, if all the enrichment opportunities are full and you don't have any stamps, you can choose from any other open sessions. Keep in mind, the library is going to be open for test retakes, independent studies. We'll also have a couple computer labs open if you have to do some extra research or any papers that you have to type. But just remember, you're going to want to get to the sessions. So keep going over that schedule and know what your plan is when you leave second period. Have your planner out, ready to roll. Thanks a lot, Mr. Hudson and Mr. Galloway. I only have one more question. How will I know where the classes are located? Cameron, once again, man, you cease to amaze me, always having great questions. His schedule will be released every Monday morning. Uh, teachers, uh, during late arrival time, they'll create their schedule and they'll post that. So they'll be showing that to you during third period uh, advisory that day. We'll also have them posted around campus. So classes could change week to week. So you wanna make sure that you get there, you take a look at that schedule and know exactly where you're going for the week. So, hey, again, this is going to be a great opportunity for you guys. We're so happy uh, that uh, you've taken on this journey with us this week in the saga of Benny. So let's make it a great week. Dominate enrichment. Adios. <laughs>